Today we're going to be talking about a fun project to do and this is fun for all ages. You're going to need some coffee filters and some markers and also a squirt bottle with some water in it. All right, I'm going to give each of my kids a coffee filter. Pass that to Charlotte, please. All right, you can use any colors, whatever colors they like. Just flatten out your coffee filter and sometimes I like to give some direction as to, yes, yeah, it'll kind of pop up a little bit. Just try to flatten it out as good as you can. Sometimes I like to give some direction um, depending on what we're going to be doing with the coffee filter. Um, there are some different things you can do. Um, here's some examples. This one I turned into a flower. Um, this one um, we made a butterfly. This one is kind of like a flower. You can um, kind of hang it, turn it into a flower. I kind of, it's kind of the same pattern to make the flower, but it's a little bit more layers and I kind of trim the edges. This one, you take a pattern, um, but it's kind of makes it into a 3D shape. It's the ballerina skirt. Um, but depending on what you want to do with a coffee filter, kind of depends on how you want to color it. Um, but today we're just going to show you how to get started. So I'm not going to give any direction. Um, so right now we're just gonna get um, started with coloring our coffee filter. So pick any color and, and you're just gonna wanna use some good markers because the more ink you put on your coffee filter, the best the ink's going to spread. So um, some good markers, ones that aren't running out is the best ones to use. So let's get started. If you have a small child, um, one that's a little bit younger, um, like my kindergartner, you might need to help hold the coffee filter still so it doesn't crinkle up on them. Mm. Okay, we've got all of our circles colored. I'll hold yours up. Okay, now we're gonna show you our next step. We're gonna take these outside and squirt them with water. And this is a really neat part that a lot of kids like to see because the colors are gonna blend. So I'm gonna show you our next step. All right, let's take, go outside. All right, so I recommend putting it on something because the colors will bleed through. So I just have an old cardboard box. And like I said, I have our colored um, coffee filters and a water squirt bottle. All right, so let me show you what you're gonna do. You're just gonna squirt it with a couple of squirts. And as you can see, the colors will start to bleed and a little bit more water you put, the more the ink in the markers will start to go. All right, now you want, don't want to put too, too much because then they will start to go too much together. All right, here you go, guys. Do a little bit more. Perfect. Okay, your turn. Yeah, go all around your circle. Don't put it right on top. Back it up just a little bit. I see he didn't get some of the edges, so we're gonna go around the edges. Let me see. Did you see it start to go out? There it goes. Oh, that's pretty. What is making peach color? 
Yep, and the colors will start to blend together. And especially being outside on a nice sunny day like this, it won't take too long to dry. All right, our coffee filters are dry. They were really out in the sun for only maybe two minutes before they were pretty much dry. And as you see, this is why we wanted to put them on something other than our table or even the cement, um, because you see where they left this um, mark, which is actually kind of pretty, but you don't want to do this on your kitchen table because you don't want the ink to bleed through, um, which is actually very pretty, but um, you don't want to dye your table with the ink. So this is mine. Um, which turned into this cool tie-dye effect. Let me see yours, baby. Um, now my son, my kindergarten son, you saw he didn't have as much ink on his, um, but you still see it really turned out to this cool tie-dye effect as well. So even if you don't put as much marker, if you have a little one that's not gonna color as much on theirs, you still see it did put a really cool, um, nice effect because um, the ink will still run together when you add the water. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you have a great day.